My name is Stacey Foster and I'm from South Africa originally. I uh, am a researcher here at the Genocide Museum and Institute and I'm working on a project around reparations, particularly from the socio-cultural perspective. My uh, journey to Armenia is kind of a work of fate. Uh, my partner managed to do some work here and I found myself uh, without something particular to do, so I joined AVC and managed to get a working position here at the museum. But very soon after, there was an opportunity to get a grant from the government to work in a five-year research project with some of the researchers here at the museum. I am very pleased to be here. It's important to me because my PhD was on conflict resolution using museums in relation to South Africa and post-apartheid. And my perspective here is quite different to most people because I came to the space almost as a perpetrator, a, a descendant of perpetrators. Uh, and in that sense, I'm not a survivor of trauma, but I bring a perspective of how we might work in partnership with perpetrators and how we might use museums, objects and cultural spaces to understand trauma, to work towards reconciliation and conflict resolution. I'm currently working with Dr. Edita Gazoyan on the issue of reparations for the genocide. Dr. Gazoyan is a legal historian, whereas I am more in the realm of art history and we're working together to think about an interdisciplinary approach to reparations. Uh, actually, our institution uh, is not only the museum, which is the most important part of our activities. We have also an institution where we are uh, conducting scientific research. This one, which Stacey is involved in, is about the legal implications of the Armenian Genocide, most particularly the reparation, the issue of reparation. This is for the first time we are conducting this research and the aim, the final aim, is to have a legal department that will be involved in the research of different as legal aspects of the Armenian Genocide. My research impacts the situation in Armenia in the sense that much of the research remains in an academic discourse, but because my research focuses on museums and public interaction, it has a, a major impact on how we teach, how we engage with the story and how we work to bring in the public. Since I'm not Armenian, it's really important to me to get a perspective that is lived in and that is from the heart of the Armenian people. I've spent a lot of time learning the language, trying to work towards a picture that is not my own. Being here during the month of April is important in that I get to understand a sense of the Armenian experience of genocide. 